as far as India's COVID tally is concerned, India's COVID chart continued to show improvement today with the country recording 1.06 lakh cases, which is a drop of 12% from yesterday's 1.14 lakh infections that were reported to be the lowest in two months. The country's caseload now stands at 2.89 crore. More than 23 crore vaccine doses have been administered so far in our country under the mega inoculation plan. However, states continue to face shortage of the two vaccines currently being used. My colleague Sukirti Dwedi joins us live. Sukirti, the numbers may be decreasing in terms of COVID cases and deaths, but how are we faring as far as the vaccination drive is concerned? Well, yes, uh, the number is slightly better in comparison to the kind of crisis that we were seeing in the last two weeks of April. Uh, compared to that, uh, the numbers are much better now. Our deaths are not at uh, 4,000. They are at about 2,400 right now. Uh, but of course, on the vaccination front, we still need a lot more improvement. Uh, we've been carrying out anywhere between 25 to 30 lakh vaccinations per day. But there are still several states that are facing a huge crisis of vaccines. For example, in Delhi for the 18 to 45 for age group, uh, they, the Delhi government does not have any vaccine stock at this point of time. Uh, the only stocks that are available are with private hospitals at this point of time. So a lot of people who cannot afford to pay for the vaccines, people from uh, the backward economic classes, they are facing difficulty in getting vaccinated at this point of time. Uh, the much easier system of walking into any uh, government school where one could get vaccinated for free, all of that system has collapsed due to the shortage of vaccines. So that vaccine availability is still to be replenished uh, based on the kind of promises that the center had made that uh, in June and July, uh, more stocks of vaccines would be coming in. So that is still awaited.